Cell phone video captures the drama playing out in a Tacoma neighborhood as an armed man runs after a deadly confrontation with police officers. Officers responded to the scene and contained that area from South M Street to Hosmer Street and then from 38th Street to Wright Street. Cairo 7's Maria Guerrero has been gathering information from the scene in Tacoma since early this morning. Maria, what's the latest from there? Well, investigators, Michelle, are still on the scene processing the suspect's vehicle, and you can see it sort of in between of those two uh, white vans. It has several bullet holes in the windshield. There are a lot of evidence markers as well on the ground. The woman who was killed is believed to be Native American and in her 20s. A witness out here told me that she saw officers carry the woman out to this area over here to try to do CPR, but she died here on the scene. And now the big thing that's happening right now is that the search continues for her passenger who police say ran off with a rifle. Chopper 7 was overhead as Tacoma police investigators gathered evidence on the street and in and around this light green car at the center of an officer involved shooting just before midnight near Sawyer Street and South Wright Avenue. We just hear a gunshot and we run outside and the police get inside the house. This man heard more shots after that. Yeah, we heard of one and then uh, after that first one it was about like two three minutes and then like two or three other fire would uh, other shots were fired. Police say two officers approached the car to arrest the passenger Kenneth Wright Jr on two felony warrants including robbery. When they got close police say a woman in her 20s driving the car stepped on the gas and tried to run down the officers on foot. One officer opened fire killing the woman. Police say Wright then ran off with a rifle setting off a massive search captured by a Cairo 7 viewer. It's kind of shocking. Greg Johnson woke to police combing his neighborhood. They was driving like they're doing now. They're going up and down the street. They had this corner blocked off, and they had that corner blocked off, and they had the alley blocked off. There was like 100 police coming by, and I'm going, what is going on? The search closed Reed Elementary and sent Whitman Elementary into a modified lockdown and has left some in this neighborhood on edge. I don't know what his intentions are or what his thinking is. The Tacoma police officer who fired his gun is 30 years old. He has been with Tacoma PD for two years now and has eight years of experience within law enforcement. He is on standard paid leave right now. Reporting live in Tacoma, Maria Guerrero, Cairo 7 News. And we've posted the picture of Kenneth Wright Jr. on our Facebook page. He is 32 years old and is believed to be a transient. Share the photo to help police track him down.